Oh, two dollars. Oh, two dollars. Bitch. This is so cute. Whoa, that's cute. I'm <laughs> Sis, you ain't have to put me on blast like that. So if you're watching this, my feelings are hurt, first off. Yeah, now I feel like I have to take a nervous poop, and I hate that. I literally hate that. Like, a nervous poop is crazy. Because it should never take you 10 minutes to back out of a parking spot. Ever. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Me and my cousin are having like a sleepover situation. Hold on. Y'all look, I just got a gift. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. Wonder who it's by. No, I'm just joking. Sidebar to the conversation. My dad just gifted me this really nice diffuser. If y'all follow me on Instagram, then you've probably seen me post my cousin Jada before. She's super fly, super cool. Jada is like a little sister that I never got to have. We were on the phone the other day and she was like, I'm actually free Thursday and Friday. I ain't got nothing to do. I'm gonna come stay with you. And I'm like, yeah. So I took Friday off work. I took a vacation day Friday, but I do work tomorrow. So she's coming tomorrow. So I'm in the guest room. If it looks familiar, yes, this is where I found my trial halls. I've had a super productive day and it's 1044. I probably won't go to bed till 12, but you know what? I work from home, it's cool. Sometimes you be zonked out at the desk. That's what coffee's for. But anyways, I'm in the guest room. I washed the sheets earlier. So I'm gonna record me putting the sheets on the bed, but I just wanted to start the video and welcome you guys back to another video. I have this caddy that I normally put like stuff in that a guest would need. So we're gonna redo this whole caddy because it looks a little crazy right now. So anyways, let's put these sheets on this bed. They're fresh and clean. I did wash them and then we're gonna do the little caddy. We're gonna put some snacks and make it look cute. Your girl cooks, okay? Twice baked potato, salmon and asparagus. Yeah, get at me. like a little bin of emergency stuff. I'm gonna clean this out real quick and then we're going to fill it up. Fill it up. I'll show y'all what I got. I'm gonna put some Tylenol powders in there. I'm gonna put some Olay bar soap, just one. One Dove sensitive bar soap. I'm gonna put six little glass wipe, glasses wipe thingies. Two burpees, chapsticks. One brand new, don't play with me, deodorant. And then I'm gonna put two Sprite Zeros, two Tate Bake Shop cookies, two things of Gushers, two things of Pringles, <laughs> and two things of pistachios. Up here. I think that looks good. What do you guys think? 
And then I'll leave in here to make it a little bit, yeah. I washed some towels, so I'm about to fold the towels. I just washed her two towels and then I'm gonna give her like four wash rags. These towels were actually already clean, but I rewashed them. She'll be like, is this for me or is this fresh laundry? No, that's for you, my girl. But yeah, that's pretty much it for tonight. It's currently 11.23. So I'm about to call it a night. I'm about to clean up my little mess that I made. Like put the stuff where it belongs back. Um, and yeah, the sheets are clean. The bed is made. The room itself is clean. It was never dirty. Only thing I didn't do, I didn't mop in here, but I did vacuum, so it's fine. And I didn't clean the ceiling fan, but you know what? It's cool. Um, oh, I think the only thing left to do is plug in an air freshener. So I'll set a reminder on my phone to do that in the morning. But yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Yeah, too, because I stayed up late cleaning that room up for you. <laughs> didn't get a thank you. Girl, I I said, oh my gosh, it looks so nice. That's what I said. That was my response. That means thank you and all that. Oh, you're welcome. Nice, real comfy, real good. Mm -hmm. Period. Hey, y'all. Happy Thursday. I keep thinking today, Friday, but it's Bitch. not because I'm off tomorrow. That's why I keep thinking it's Friday. But Jada's here. Hey, y'all. Okay, I look crazy, though. But Not really, but they can't really see you that much. Okay, but I still look crazy. We about to... um. Call the Chinese restaurant and order some food. She ain't from here, so hopefully the Chinese food match up to her standards. I don't know, <laughs> but it, it's pretty all right to me. It's pretty all right. Well, you never had the honey wings before. I don't be getting that stuff. I don't get no honey wings. I don't really like wet stuff. I like dry rub chicken. Ew. Like even when I go to um, what's it called? Wing stop. Mm. Bro, I used to work. She used to work at Wing. <laughs> I forgot about that. I waited there for nine months. Is that the one where your mama had to go curse them out? Girl, yes. Yeah. I love a 10 piece boneless hot and honey. I'm telling you right now. Boneless, girl, that's nasty. They bone in is nasty. No, their bone in is good. They bone in is dry. No, you know what's Maybe better? Maybe not at that location. Their tenders are good. Oh, let me see your phone case. This it's is real so cute. cute. Y'all, look how cute. Where did you get this from? <laughs> What? Mm -hmm. That's so cute. I'm about to get me one. Yeah, this guy's so cute. It's like childish, but cute. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, all right, we're going to order this food. You're going to have to tell me. Well, let me look at what you said. You want me to order it just like you said it? You say you want... What did you say? Crab ragoon. And, oh, lo mein and honey wings. They lo mein good? Yeah. Is they pansy good? What? Pansy? What, this, what is that? You know what pansy is? So you want... Wait, honey... you never had a sesame chicken? I think maybe. Um, no. What have you had from there? Girl, uh, do they take Applebee's? Yeah, they do. Hello, can I get a menu? Hi, can I get an order of, and that's it. May I have the total, please? Let me see. Can I get a total of uh, 32.50. It don't come with egg rolls? Do it come with egg rolls? You want egg rolls? How much, egg roll? how much, egg roll? how much is it? Uh, two dollars. How many egg rolls? One dollar, one, one egg or two dollars? Uh, two dollars. Uh, two dollars. Okay, how many wine though? Yeah, however much it costs. Give me however much two dollars get me. Yeah, wine or two dollars. Okay, yeah, give me one. Okay, that's all. Yeah, that's it. Okay, thank you. Thank you. That's not you what you No, no that's, nah. not, that's not what the f he said. He said. He said $2 for one egg roll. You talk about some $2 egg roll. <laughs> you talk about some, like, you talk about some, I want the $2 one. Huh? What? She said. Yeah. <laughs> she slow. Nah, he know good and well. He said one for one dollar, two for no, $2. No, he said, he said $2 for one egg roll. You talk well, about some. Well, if you knew, you should have said No, do you like? Yeah, $2. <laughs> I'm like, huh? Okay, please. <laughs> please. So I'm thinking you just said, oh, combo egg roll. Girl, but anyways, we about to go to the gas station and then we going to Walmart because she want to do matching pajamas. So we wally, 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 wally. Now you're going to have that song stuck in my head. Brokey. 
Oh, these are cute. Look. Those are cute. Oh, look, anyone is so cute. Do they have my size? Okay, we don't got a match. It could just be onesies. Y'all, look. You want to do onesies? How much are they? And these look cute. I don't do no black. <laughs> but yeah. I don't like black. The onesies are cuter. They are. I was looking at them. Stitch. These are so cute though. <laughs> oh, girls, I'm just pulling my car. Huh? Huh? <laughs> So now we about to go get this Chinese food, Chinese food. Oh, so Chinese food. you gonna go in there with me? Cause it be a little, it be ghetto. like, a, not ghetto, but it be, yeah, Josh always get the food for me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a grub. Yeah, we got the spray, you know. Okay, huh? We have a nice red and mirror. Red and mirror. <laughs> red and mirror, it's, it's not good? It's good. Oh, okay. I keep, I like, you know, some people keep like ginger ale in their house. Mm-hmm. I keep that. Like I just finished the other bottle yesterday. You know, tea girl. Mm-mm. I'm on a Palmer girl. My dad loves that. I know. I like fruit. Nope. Hate fruit. What? Mm -hmm. I'm sugary. I love me a good fruit punch from McDonald's. Mm-mm. No, I do high seed. That's about it. Mm. Orange. Mm-hmm. Allergic to it. Whatever. You allergic to orange high seed? Mm-hmm. I'm allergic to orange. And orange soda? I think I knew that. <laughs> so you can't even have lemon. Mm -mm. Wait, this have lemon in it. It's fine. Now I'm gonna die. Who I did was this. Mm -hmm. Alright y'all, we're gonna watch a movie or something. Very much something. I'm gonna call y'all back. We ain't doing nothing anyways. We can't even decide on what to watch. We watching the game. Okay, we're watching the game. Not like sports, like the show, the game, but, you know, Tia Samara. <laughs> Tia Samara. <laughs> Whichever one. Wait, which one wait, I think Samara. No, oh, Tia. Tia? Yeah, it was Tia. The Good morning. I really don't have much planned for today. I had just planned to hang out with Jada. So Jada's still here. She's currently getting ready. Don't mind those bags. That's the stuff that we got from... TJ Maxx in my last vlog. We're gonna we're gonna mess with that on Sunday. Today's Friday. Okay. One day at a time. So the plan for today right now is to um go make some money. Yeah. So I wanna go to Plato's well, I'm going to Plato's closet. So I have two bags of clothes. <laughs> so yeah, I'm kind of just going with the flow. I really don't know what today's gonna consist of. But all I know is Plato's Closet and Ulta. Those are the only two things that's really on my list for real. We made it to Plato's Closet with Jada mad because one, I parked hella far, and two, she right. wanted to go sit in at somebody's restaurant. These are my two little bags of clothing. So, I'm about to take it in and see what we can get. Okay. Went into Old Navy and then we also went into Ross, but it wasn't much like worth filming. So, because we walked over here. So, Plato's Wildly just texted me three minutes ago saying that my pickup was ready. So, let's go see if your girl made any money. Okay, so Plato's Closet was like kind of a fail. My goal was like nothing less than 45, but they took 11 of my items. So, I'm pretty sure they took like their brand new stuff. We are about to go to. Ulta, cause she gotta get a bunch of stuff. I just needed one little thing. So we finally made it to Ulta. Just came in here for the vibes. No, I got the two. For the vibes. Oh my gosh, they got them. <laughs> the hell can you come for veggies? Mm -hmm. Do they work? Yeah, no. They for the. They just for the vibes. Let me see. Are you getting them? Mm -hmm, for sure. Those are cute. I thought about trying to let me sleep. They gotta let me matcha, let me glow, let me purr. Let me curb, let me burn, let me deep blow. What's this, a, tri a trial size? What you need her contour for? I do it kind of further up. It depends on your face shape. Oh, what's this brand? I've never seen this brand oh before. Oh my gosh, look how cute this one is. That is cute. All right. That's super cute. I think I'm gonna get it. Yeah. I've been wanting to try this. This uh, glow getter body lotion. What? I definitely know that the body wash is my favorite. This is what I came in here for, guys. But 
Yeah, I came in here for this one. The True Cream. I did try the Aqua Bomb last time, but I really like the True Cream better, so I'm gonna get another one of these, so. You gotta try so the this bag Micro Brush, huh? You gotta try the 15 one. Is it here? Yeah. Oh, well, then, what was oh. it? Fenty's over there, oh, right? Oh, no, you told me to try, try these first. Well, no, it was right there. The Fenty one was right there. I don't like none of these. They don't got, they all dark, and this one is ugly. Really? What's, oh, no, it's some right here, look. It said, it's that brown one, this one right here, look. You talk about some insane. I'm gonna try this. Wipe it open, this one right there. Whoa, that's cute. I'm about to get it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you know what? That's I might want that one too. I'm about to get it. Don't tell me it's only one more. It's only one. Hold on. It's only one. Let's ask the lady. Alright, you can have it. No, do you need it? No, you can have it. Hey y'all, we are back in the car. I'm gonna show you guys what I got real quick. From Ulta, Jada convinced me to try this new, this mascara from Fenty and I have been looking for a mascara cause I don't know if I told y'all but I broke my <laughs> mascara wand the other day. I was rushing, I was like this and the whole thing broke off. And then I got a full size of this because I really, really like it, so yeah. And then from Five Below, I got this phone stand. I'm gonna put this on my desk in my office. Hopefully y'all can see it. It's cute. I got these because these are so good. These are freeze dry candies, rainbow bites. They're the, um, are these the sour ones? I think so. I hope so. Mm-hmm, try the green one. I got some of these because I'm hungry. And then I got a Sprite. We're gonna get some food. So I'll talk to y'all in a little bit. I'm finally home. It's 5.14, which is crazy. Cause it feels earlier than that. I'm all set. I ordered us some Crab Ragoon. Then I ordered us something new. This is called the Dragon Roll. I don't know. But it looks really, really good. Two deluxe California rolls. Two regular California. The girl is hungry. Hey y'all, good morning. Happy Saturday. So today, I'm actually about to go to a workout class. There's this place called Pure Bar. I'm sure you have heard of it before. Y'all, my hair. I didn't want to put no products on it, so I put it in a low ponytail. But because I didn't put any products on it, it kind of looks poofy <laughs> right here. Like, I don't really know. Because, you know, like, my roots are curly right They're curling up a little bit because I haven't put any heat on my hair. So, yeah. But it's currently, like, 50 degrees outside, y'all. So, yeah. Um... But I just have on my black Lulu jacket. I have on some green Lulu leggings. And I have on my Tasman Uggs. And for the class, thankfully, I left my, I don't know if that's nasty or not. But I still have my, I still had a pair of grip socks in my car. But you need to have long leggings on. And then you need to have, well she said leggings past your knees I think. And then you need to have full coverage grip socks, like your toes can't be out. So from what I read, Pure Bar is like a um, mixture of Pilates and like a full body workout and I guess like a little bit of ballet because there's a bar in there. This is just an introduction class, it's literally only 30 minutes. It's from 1045 to 1115 if I'm not mistaken. So they said to get there 15 minutes early they also said that you cannot film during the class, but they said that my class is the last class of the day before they close. So I'm welcome to stay like after and get some clips in the studio. So I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna film short form content and then I'll just insert the clips of like whatever I gather from the experience in the video. I don't know if I'm gonna get a membership because the same thing like Club Pilates offers the same thing you can try your first class free and if you like it you sign up oh I'm meant to say I'm actually meeting up with 
um, an associate of mine. This is our first little like meet and greet. So we're going to um, meet up at, um, oh, the girl just got her hair done and she's like taking a little selfie. So she looks so cute. Um, <laughs> but we're gonna meet up at Pure Bar and we're gonna take the intro class together. So I brought me some snacks. And I got food at the house. I'm really not trying to spend no money. I got food at the house. The only thing I'll spend some money on is Starbucks because, yeah, duh, matcha, matcha. And then, of course, they told me to bring your own water. So I put some ice in here and some water. So I got my, my simple modern. I will talk to you guys in a little bit. So, yeah, the lighting is crazy. I just pulled up to the place. I was a bit confused. Not me thinking... The Waze app is better than Apple Maps. Waze took me to the other side of the parking lot. So I'm like, you're at your destination. So when I got to the other side, I was like, well, this isn't right. But I wasn't sure where to go. So I put in Apple Maps. Apple Maps took me right here. So sometimes Apple Maps is good and sometimes she ain't all that. I don't know why I parked so far. It's literally right there. But they had a parking spot in front. But I didn't want to park right in front. I was like, so I'm nervous. I wasn't nervous until now. But yeah, now I feel like I have to take a nervous poop and I hate that. I literally hate that. Like a nervous poop is crazy because I don't have time. So <laughs> so it's 1025. I'm going to go in at 1030. I'll see y'all after the workout. <laughs> okay, so Pure Bar was a 10 out of 10. But the intro class was intense. I'm not going to lie. The instructor really like pushed us um girl when i tell you you don't realize you're out of shape until you're in a class and you're doing these exercises and you feel like you can't go anymore like i'm glad i wasn't the only person that stopped a couple times i only allowed myself to stop like once or twice though and then i no i'm lying i stopped like three four times but i pretty much pushed through for most of the exercises but yeah, I was like, wow, I'm out of shape. And the, it was only four of us in there. So now, I'm hungry. I'm going to go grab me a snack. I was going to go to Crumble to get the Crumble cookies for this week. Because they got the Tres Leche. And they also have the Caramel Apple Cookie. But honestly, I don't feel like going over there that way. And then I don't really feel like wasting money on cookies. $20 on some cookies. So definitely with sweating um so the silk press is no longer silky it's definitely given curled up so yeah but it was a fun little class but yeah the instructor was super cool she was very like she wasn't the type of instructor that made you feel like you didn't know what you were doing because obviously it's an introduction class who, like nobody really knows what they're doing they we're being introduced to it i feel like when i went to pilates the instructor was not nearly as like calm and inviting as that instructor was like when I was at and it could have just been the location but when I did Club Pilates and no shade to Club Pilates at all like it was cool and I do it again I do Pilates again I just do it at a different location but I feel like when I did Club Pilates it, the instructor was just like okay now switch like she wasn't really telling us what was what this instructor oh she was on it baby she was on it she was telling us you know what to do like i feel the workout i feel the burn in my stomach right now maybe i shouldn't get starbucks <laughs> i didn't think i was gonna like it as much as i do like i like this way better than pilates way better i did not think i was gonna like it this much like i was prepared to be like nope not gonna lie i was really prepared to be like no but i liked it give me a matcha i'm i'm done with the fall drinks that brown sugar shake and espresso was not my jam as much as i wanted to like it girl it wasn't my jam and i just i don't know so i'm gonna stick to what i know but i might get the matcha with pumpkin cold foam Hey, how are you doing today? Good, how are you? Doing great, thank you for asking. What can we set up for you? May I have a grande iced matcha latte with almond milk? For you. Can I add two pumps of vanilla, two pumps of brown sugar, and sweet cream cold foam? May I also have a chocolate croissant? Warmed up today? Yes, please. Sure thing, what else can I get for you? That'll be all.
Hey y'all. So I don't think I've ever mentioned it, but my one of my brothers has his license. So he about to take me to the store. Yeah, I love this. I never thought that I was gonna like this. I like this. Having somebody else in the house that got a license. Yeah, take me. Take me, Uber. Take me Lyft. Yes. <laughs> but yeah, we about to go to Walmart because Taisha commented on my real. Talking about some, my ponytail was cringy and it's only been a week. Sis, you ain't have to put me on blast like that. So if you're watching this, my feelings are hurt, first off. Second of all, I wa immediately got on my Zoom and watched videos on how to revive a silk crest. I thought I had a small thing of um, dry shampoo, but I don't know where it's at. So I'm about to go to Walmart. I'm going to get some dry shampoo, like a roller brush. And I might get some brand new like flexi rod things, but that's it. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to dry shampoo my hair. I'm going to blow dry it with the round brush. And then I'm going to, I'm going to try to flexi ride it. I may or may not. It depends because my hair is like bone straight. Cool. So I'll see how we get to Walmart. Okay, y'all, we made it into Walmart. And the girlies on TikTok were saying to get the Batiste original. So they have two sizes. They got this one, this one. I think I'm going to get the small one. Cause we just need her for a good time, not a long time. So we're gonna get the small one. And then, I do need another brush. Cause the brush I have hurts my head so bad when I do my slick backs. I don't know, I can't tell if this is hard or not. Why is this? Three dollars. I can get this cheaper on Amazon. I'm gonna just go ahead and get this. And then I need a round brush. It's kind of big, but this can't be the only one they have. Hold on. Okay, I found the round brushes. Almost had a a moment. All right, so I don't know if I should get this one or I should get this one. I'm thinking this one though. Yeah, I'm gonna get this one. And then they don't have no other combs that's cheaper. They have to. Because the $3 comb is crazy. But that one has the rat tail on it. Oh, they have this. For $1.86. Yeah, put this back. Ooh. $5. That's cute. I didn't come for that though. Um, let's see. Oh wait, they got this round brush. Oh, that's homegirl from the Bachelorette. Or the Bachelor, whatever. Tasha. She had her own hairline, period. Um What's this? Styling? Oh. Alright, I'm finna go check out. That's all I need to get. Okay, bag secured. I'm about to go revive this silk press. So Taja can't say nothing else about it. I can't believe she commented that thing on my... I'm about to text her and be like, you really hurt my feelings. Because why would you do me like that? Raise your hand if you live in an area where nobody know how to drive. <laughs> yeah. Because it should never take you 10 minutes to back out of a parking spot. Ever. I didn't even finish editing my video, y'all, my oh, other no. video, but I need to go finish doing that before I do any type of silk press revisions. But I'ma try. I don't know if I got it in me, but I'ma try to do it tonight. Successful little, I was about to call this Target. Absolutely not. Successful little Walmart run. Shout out to my brothers for taking me to the store. Well, brother, and y'all, won't believe it, my total was less than $20. Hey guys, long time no see -ski. Like mad weeks later since the last time y'all saw me. I think the last time I spoke to y'all, I had went to that introduction class at Pure Bar. Um, update, your girl ended up getting a membership to Pure Bar and I've been back since then and I actually really, really like it. But we'll talk about that another time. And now we're at Aldi. Yup, yup, yup. Since your girl is trying to get in her like fitness era, fitness bag, 
one thing I need to do is get groceries for the week so I can actually cook and make meals and nourish my body. I'll see y'all when we get inside the grocery store. Yeah, she came reading your TikTok stuff. Yeah. <laughs> 